Colin Harding. He's an analyst on Latin America and joins us from Manchester in the UK. Mr Harding, good to have you with us. Let's just start with how popular does Lula remain with Brazilians? Oh, I think, well, among his supporters, very popular. He was a, a, a very successful president in, in many ways. Um, you know, he was re-elected uh, and, and um, uh, keeps uh, this this reputation of, of being somebody who got things done and improved the lives of, of ordinary people in Brazil. Um, of course, it was a very divided country, and, and the, the, the lavajato, the, the, the car wash scandal, which implicated him and many members of his government and, and associates, uh, rather damaged his reputation, of course, but his being cleared now has been welcomed with wild celebrations with his uh, supporters. And of course, there is the possibility now that he'd be able to stand in next year's um, presidential election uh, as a rallying figure for anti-Bolsonaro uh, forces. And is it just uh, anti-Bolsonaro uh, voices and, and supporters in Brazil? Or is it the, the work that Lula did during his time in office? Just lay out for us some of the policies that he was able to bring in that's lifted people out of poverty. Well, the, the main thing was it was a thing called the, the, the Bolsa Familia, which was a, um, a, a subsidy paid to families uh, in order for their children to go to school, uh, to enable the children to go to school. You know, they, they wouldn't, because, of course, children... Uh, poor children work, uh, and this was a policy designed to enable them to go to school, and the family would be paid the equivalent of, of what the children would have earned, and so that sort of thing, and some reforms to the social security system, uh, a general increase in, in, in public spending, uh, and you know, this won him a great deal of support, and also uh, internationally. Um, the Americans, for instance, who regarded him as a left-wing figure, but he was somebody they could do business with. Uh, and I think this um, uh, attribute that he has of, of being some, something of a, a rallying figure could be very important uh, because the, the, of course, the popularity of, of, of Jair Bolsonaro was very much um, based on um, this general feeling of revulsion at the corruption that was seen to have spread through Brazilian politics during the uh, the Workers' Party uh, time in government. Uh, but that has been very badly besmirched by, by subsequent uh, events, and particularly as the handling of the of the COVID crisis. Uh, so we, we could find a situation in which in which Lula's popularity um, greatly increases uh, uh, while the, the, the election campaign goes on. Of course, he's not out of the wood yet. I mean, OK, uh, Colin, I'm sorry to interrupt you, sir, but we do have to end it, end it there. We are running out of time. Thank you very much for being with us. Colin Harding, the Latin American analyst.